Well, I'm going to try something a bit different today. I've been doing regular updates on portrait mode on my phone and putting those up on TikTok mainly. Uh, a few of them up on Facebook and Instagram and such like that. And I tend to talk for a while. You find things like, you know, YouTube shorts is limited to one minute. Um, so what I'm trying to do is do a different format and maybe talk for a bit longer. I've had some people tell me to talk shorter, but um, I've got a strategy here because I can break this down into shorter form content potentially. But um, these aren't making it up onto YouTube because they're just too long, right? I'm trying to deal with the wind. Now, I've been walking along at the moment. I'm out to go get a coffee and do my choices that I do each day and I've still got to sit down I'm gonna look in the mirror in the camera down here I've got to sit down and focus on one of my choices admittedly it's been a few days since I've sat down with one of my choices have gone through them it takes time to sit and focus and it's hard a lot of things are hard um, so Gary Vaynerchuk talking about doing here you know um, was it six to twelve pieces of content today now that's not on every platform Right, so you can spread those across different platforms, but then, you know, in the ideal that he's talking about, you then customize each of those for the platform, you know, so you, you package it, maybe do a slightly different version of it for each of those platforms. That's hard, that's a, that's a lot of time. He talks a lot about time management. He talks a lot about just documenting his day, just filming what he does. That is way harder than it sounds. You think it'd be easy, but then you go to get your phone out and there's just so many voices in your head very quickly about no one wants to see what I'm doing. No one wants to see me making a cup of coffee. Who wants to see me sitting at my computer programming for ages, trying to figure something out, being frustrated, um, along with maybe not wanting to show that I'm not being super awesomely productive, etc. There's so much of that. It's such a hard thing. I'm here worried about the wind coming in. There's wind blowing. There's people walking past, which gets you worried and concerned. And it's just got to put yourself out there. This is this is vulnerable for me. There is literally somebody just walked past. You see, and um, I saw them look at me. <laughs> and um, so what do you do, right? So I've got so much to do. I did a couple of live streams the other day looking at the Obsidian Notes app. And I've been getting a lot of people go and watch that. I haven't, I've done two of them. Just because I'm going through the help in the Obsidian Notes app as, as I figure out how to use it and how it works. Because I'm recording a podcast tomorrow night on Monday with Ivan, the Code, of, Code and Character podcast. And we are going to go through Obsidian as a topic. So I thought as preparation, I'll sit down and go through the notes. Synergize the idea, but of course I want to sit and focus. I hate focusing, so if I go live, it kind of gives me that added bonus of how can I be standing in a corner and it's windy? I don't know if you can hear that wind. I'm gonna come over here in this corner, see if I can block it out a bit. Um, you know, so I tried to tried to record myself going through those notes, and it's it's, it's it's like it's not going viral. Don't get me wrong, Mike, but it's at least like five views per day for the past few days. Um, it's, it's standing up. People aren't watching the whole thing. Now I want to download it, re-edit it, put it back up. I'm worried about repetitious content on YouTube. I think I might get away with it this one time. That's why I haven't published the other one yet because I want to download it and then upload that. Um, download it, edit it, package it up nice, then put it up, make sure it's engaging and people actually want to watch it. Uh, so there's all that to go through. I've got other ideas, I've got other videos I want to make. I want to perhaps talk to the Enneagram. I'm making my Drupal news videos. Go and look on my channel, you can find the Drupal news videos. Seems to be a niche I can target. Now it's not a niche I personally want to devote my entire self to. I, I, I do love Drupal. I've been working as a Drupal developer for 20 years. 20, 15, somewhere between 15 and 20. Rounded up, 20. Um, so I know a lot about it, but I, I don't want to work in that gig anymore. I don't want to be a Drupal developer. I'm done. I've had it with the corporate world, to be honest. Uh, I never quite fit in, and eventually I just had to acknowledge that it wasn't for me after 20 years. Uh, and now, so I'm making content and doing this and doing the Drupal news and getting some really good feedback. There's a core group of people who have gone, this is great, can you keep it up? Whether there's a huge audience for Drupal, you know, and that's struggle, that's something that goes through my mind. What's the core audience for this? Plus, I don't want to typecast myself into it. I don't want to, and I want to do more than that. I want to um, build some 
passive income and do other things and express big theme for me is personal sovereignty and so just tying myself to Drupal means I'm tied to Drupal and I don't feel that's a personal sovereignty thing that means I'm just working for this imaginary topic that I've created for myself so that's um that's so many things to do I've got so many videos to do and I'm out walking around I've got to do my choices and thinking about my time management um, you know when these other products I've got to do my just give me a second I got to put this coffee down here and swap hands <laughs> and um, so kind of look the same um, get a sore arm after so that's probably means I'll be talking long enough I can't see how long I've been talking for in five and a half minutes so we've got five and a half minutes here I'm gonna stick this directly up on YouTube I think see now even doing this I've got to come up with a thumbnail everything you do adds extra bits of work on there so maybe I won't do a thumbnail maybe I'll put the fun I don't know look I'll upload this and think about it I've got to chop it down into see if I can go about putting it into a portrait format um, see how we go there's so much going through my mind throwing mud at the wall that's the name of the game trying different things trying this out doing this long form video I don't know what I've covered I didn't have notes I've just gone free for all try and get it all out there document my journey document where I'm at get this up thanks for being with me see you next time